Hello everyone, it's Lorraine and today I wanted to come to you with a quick update about um, the Julep Oxygen Performance Top Coat um, and a clarification. Um, if you got your June box, well one, you need to pay very close attention to all the products that are available in the box, like for the June box they released two separate um, treatments, the base coat, the oxygen um, smoothing base coat, as well as the oxygen performance top coat. Now the base coat was the item that was available in all of the boxes, um, I believe except for It Girl. But the top coat was available as an add-on or if you upgrade it to the ultimate upgrade where you got every single item that was released in the box. So, and they do this quite a bit, so you have to pay attention. Generally, it's with additional polishes that are also released in the collection. Like, they'll show that there are, within the box, there'll be like maybe nine polishes, but there might be a tenth new polish that's separately available as an add-on. Um, so you have to kind of be careful and pay attention to all the products that are available because um, I know someone did mention um, or was asking questions about the whether this these two are the same. They are two different products. Again, they are these are the second and the third products available from the oxygen treatments. The first one, as I had mentioned, was the oxygen. Um, the oxygen nail treatment that's in the frosted glass but it is a t pink tinted polish as a just a base coat or um, that you should not apply polish over top of but again they released the oxygen smoothing base coat which is also in a frosted um, bottle but the base coat is white it dries to a clear matte finish and then the top coat which is in this silver packaging um, here so just be careful make sure you pay attention to all the products that are available so you can make sure that you get everything all the new products so some of them are generally not included in the actual bo regular box but as an add-on or you get it in the ultimate upgrade where you get every single polish as well as every product that's released most times so um, I did a follow-up video to this like I said that this was very worked really great over nail art now when I applied my stamping I did use regular nail polish to do my stamping so for the next manicure that I do I am going to use the um, use stamping polish to see if it smears or not with over stamping polish but um, I just wanted to also give an update on the wear so I didn't do my nails a second time last week I did my regular manicure on Monday applied the oxygen performance top coat and then on Tuesday I actually did the stamping portion of my nail design so I've had this complete manicure on since Tuesday today is Monday June the 9th so um, I've had this on since Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday for seven whole days and I am very very pleased with the wear as you can see I just have some tip wear here now my thumbs are chipped but that is because these are the two nails with the patches two of the nails that have patches on them and I always have difficulty getting the edges here which is where the splits are to be smooth and um nicely on there so for some reason ever since i've had patches on these my two thumbs these have been chipping regardless of the top coat that i've been wearing they've been chipping pre even with my ibd uv top coat so um but the rest of my nails are very very much intact and again um hopefully you can see that there is just tip wear there is no other like major chipping or anything like that so I will say that this does wear pretty well. Um, again, seven days. And then the um, only thing I will say is that this shine, is, it's not as shiny as it was, the, of course, the very first day that I applied it, but that is usually typical with most top coats. Um, to refresh it, you just have to add another coat of um, your top coat a couple days later. So um, 
I guess just keep that in mind and then also different products can dull the finish of your nail polish so I've been putting on you know my nail um, stimulator nail growth stimulator on as well as lotions and things like that and lotions and all those different products they wear down the top coat so if you are one that really wants a extremely shiny top coat um, you just may have to apply your top coat um, after a few days of wearing it to keep your, the glossiness intact but again I am extremely pleased with this I mean I'm, I'm pleased with you know the level I mean of shininess that it still has it's not like a hundred like super glossy shiny but it is still has does still have shine on it and I am extremely pleased with the wear because I wasn't too pleased with the Freedom Polymer top coat, the wear on that one. That one did not last me in no way seven days. I would say maybe three to four days in, the, that polish generally started chipping. So, um, um, so I am extremely pleased with this. Let me know if have, have you've tried it, what were your results? If you were able to, how many days of wear were you able to get? And things like that, um, leave your comments below. Um, Thanks for watching. Stay polished at all times and have a great day. Bye.